seriously? Seriously. <laughs> I gotta go to work in a few minutes. Get that crab off there. What's up guys, today I have a prank for you where me and my brother go out and prank my dad in the middle of the night. Now some things go right and some things go wrong. Well, it wasn't even that big of a thing that went wrong, but the outcome was phenomenal. So it started like a week ago, I asked my dad if I could take his car. I was like, hey dad, can I take your car? We have to um go get sticky notes and balloons for this challenge. Didn't suspect anything of it, so I was like, oh, this is perfect. I'm definitely gonna get them. And so last night was the perfect night to do it, and these are the clips. Ah, <clears throat> I was gonna yell, but it's very late right now and everyone's asleep. What I'm about to go do right now is wake up my brother because we have to go um, pull a prank on my dad. I'm sorry, dad, but we got to. Here's my dog, she's so beautiful. Say something, what's your name? Aspen. Okay, can you not look at me like you're gonna beat me up or something? Okay. because my dad's a very, very light sleeper. Any little sudden movement, he'll wake up. He's very protective, so we gotta execute this perfectly without him waking up. And I, I honestly think we can do it, so let's get to it. So right now we have balloons. We're gonna go in, fill his whole car up with balloons. There's like 30 balloons in here. I think 30 balloons alone would be very annoying, so why not do 30? He has to get up from work very early in the morning, right? a very light sleeper. It took me like 10 minutes to open that door. <laughs> Did it not? And when it opened, it goes <coughs> like it just made a loud noise. So I'm surprised we're, we've even been out this long. That's why I keep looking. And it's 12:30 in the morning. Oh yeah. It is too damn early. It is 12:35 in the morning. So um, like too damn early. Yeah. Yeah, it's early. All right. So let's go ahead and get this started. Here, take some blues. <sighs> All right. So. Stretch it out before you do it. He does not blow balloons. Alright, so. Alright, obviously, we're really bad at this. The door's wide open, so my dad's gonna wake up any moment, probably. Hopefully he doesn't though. And I still haven't blown up this balloon at all. Is it shut all the way? Okay, clearly I'm not a balloon expert. I think we got the wrong balloons. These are so tiny. Yeah, I don't know how I didn't see that they were seven inch balloons. I thought it said 17 inch, but that was 17 centimeters. Next time I'll make sure to read the fine print. But we have a shit ton of post-it notes so balloons are horrible but the post-it notes when i put them on there will be a whole lot better but he has to go to sleep right now and i'm gonna do the post-it notes myself so um thank you for helping me out thank you for blowing up those seven inch balloons and we should have bought more it will but uh yeah so see you in the next clip all right guys what's up uh i just had to go through like the most to get out of my house because my front door is very loud when you open it so i had to hop the fence throw the camera over, throw the tripod over, throw the sticky notes. So let's get this time-lapse thing started. I also got a cute little gold bow to put right on the top of his car. I thought it'd be fun. Okay, just dropped all of the post-it notes. Fantastic, let's just start now. Just leave it up to me to do that.
cute little bow for him, you know. Gotta, gotta be nice. You know, it's a little present to him. I've had two people stop me and say, that's dedication right there. I said that because they're from Texas, so they have a little bit of an accent. If you're curious as to why I'm taping everything down, it's because we got hurricane force winds at uh, 7 o'clock in the morning, so yeah. Car is all done now. I just gotta wait for him to get ready and come out here for work. It is currently 8.09. He doesn't wake up for like another hour or something. Yeah, he used to be to work at 11, so hopefully I don't have to go ahead and help him take all this off. Hopefully he takes it off himself. Uh, I have not slept at all, so um, I'm a little tired. So uh, now we just wait. Hey, Dad, there's a, what? There's a, there's what? a gift outside. I don't... Nick, come on, stop. <laughs> Damn, look at that farmer's tan. All right. <laughs> what do we got? I think you're gonna love it. I don't, I don't like surprise. Well, this one's, this one's nice. Couldn't even tell, a quartz knife? I'm sorry. Seriously? Seriously. <laughs> I gotta go to work in a few minutes. Get that crab off there. All right, dude, I gotta get ready. Do you like it? <laughs> I, don't I mean, I had to use a lot of tape, I'm sorry. Where'd you get the post-it notes? Well, remember that one night you let me take your car and I said, oh, it's for a challenge for me and Brandon? Oh, all right. See the balloons? I got them yeah. a size too small. How'd you get in the car, though? Uh, your keys. You leave them on your lunchbox all the time. Nick, my lunchbox is in there. Yeah, I know, but you <laughs> left them on the key ring, so it was even better. Right. So, um, you're going to have one hell of a time taking no, these off. Oh, crap off. I got to go to work. <laughs> you better not screw my paint job, either. Oh, yeah, yeah. I didn't say nothing about the bugs. It's the paint job. Just get it cleaned up. <laughs> you, do you know I can take off just a little bit of it? Why? I didn't do it. <laughs> get the rest of shit off. God, I'm like, I gotta go to work. I don't have time for this. All right, well I'll make, I'll keep it on there. His reaction was so chill. It was just like a, like a blank face in a way. And I was like, come on, Dad. Like you're not gonna freak out a little bit. Nothing crazy. Like you're just gonna be like, make sure to clean it up. It's kind of funny. And like giggle. I mean, it was a good reaction. Yeah, but I thought he was gonna be over the top and like super wild. But uh, I, that's not my dad. I feel like that's where I get my um chill attitude from I guess you know I'm not really ah, ah, screaming everywhere you know what I'm saying so like I don't know I feel like that kind of rubbed off a little bit so I wish I wish we weren't so chill of a family and we just we kind of just were a little extra with it but that being said if that got him to act like that that means I had to step up my game and do a bigger prank on his car or a bigger prank on him to where he does kind of freak out a little bit and that's what I want I want him to like actually be mad that I did something funny to him you know what I'm saying I think we got this. So if this video gets 250 likes, I will go ahead and re-prank my dad and make it a bigger and better prank than, than this one was. So that's all for today's video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this prank. Uh, I know I did. I know Brandon did. It was very fun. So make sure to give it a like. If you enjoyed the video, comment down below what other pranks you would want me to do. And subscribe if you haven't. Subscribe, subscribe if you haven't because there's going to be a tons of pranks. Turn on the post notifications of mine so you never miss when I post. My social medias are down below. And as always, remember to take your socks off before you go to sleep so your feet can breathe. And um, see you guys next week. Oh, 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 oh